This is the Batum 3 series by General Bites. Okay, so you've got your contracts from the sales department. You look like a deer in the headlights, though. What do you do next? Watch this. I'll tell you. The email contains two contracts. The first is a sales agreement. The second is a license and service agreement. Normal stuff, firstborn child, yada, 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 yada. Click on the icon to open up to the Sign Now site. You'll be brought to this screen. It starts at the bottom. You have to scroll up to fill in all the little details. Double check the fine print. Make sure the required entries are all green. When you're ready, submit the form. Now do the same for the license and service agreement. Submit it. Done. Voila. You'll receive a confirmation email after completing the two contracts, and PDF copies of the forms will be attached to it. The sales team will inspect the documents, and if they're okay, the team will send you the invoice in a reply. If you prefer to pay by wire transfer, the banking information is also found on the invoice. For this example, I demonstrate a Bitcoin payment. I click the link to Bitcoin Pay, confirm the amounts, then transmit the funds to complete the sale. Easy. Shipping confirmation will be sent to you, as well as an ETA. Now, while you're waiting for your prize, you should probably contact a customs clearing agent. In the U.S., navigate over to the U.S. Customs and Border Patrol for a list of suggestions. You have to dig a little. This is an international shipment of a high-tech item. There will be paperwork, and the paperwork must be in order to clear customs. Heads up. After it's cleared customs, this 400-pound coffin will arrive at your door, normally within a few days. If the tilt sensor exceeds 30 degrees when it arrives, put that fact in writing. Put it on the bill of lading, write it on the shipping receipt, take pictures. Get proof if this expensive item may have been damaged in transit. Notify the sales team that you've safely received your new BATM and they will reply with the final pieces of information you need to install it. Make sure to note in your email if the bottom has been tilted or otherwise damaged in shipping. You also need to decide upon a server, and for the sake of expedience, include that decision in the same email. There are two choices. Use the General Bytes cloud server or host your own server. The cloud server is better for you if you want to keep it fast and simple. If you're not a techie, use the cloud. It's always the latest and greatest, requires the least setup, demands zero maintenance, and it's free for the first month. You'd also be up and running immediately. On the other hand, if you bring your own server, you'd gain complete privacy and control. The benefits may be worth it. Here's an example of the costs. After the first free month, we charge only one half of 1% of all your transactions. So if you conduct $10,000 in sales for that month, your fee would be about $50. If you set up your own server, you have to pay a monthly hosting fee, retain your own tech support, and any downtime, it adds up. You will be responsible for installation, configuration, and all maintenance. Yes, you gain absolute control and privacy, but only you can decide what that's worth. Once you have made this excruciating decision, Notify the sales team. Reply with, yes, sign me up for the cloud, please. Or if you plan a self-host, I want a license key now. They'll respond accordingly. Now, prepare for the next step. Unboxing. This is all detailed in the next video.